Hey everybody, I am Pete, this is the Ever Canadian, and we got a real treat here. We've got the Pico Gallico Arcade Collection 2. This is my initial first impression, first reaction to this cart. Just got it. Please go check out my unboxing video if you want to see all the goodies that's inside the actual case with the collection. But here we're just doing a quick little run through on each of the games. There's only six games on here, and not too many carts have had such a lead up of people not really impressed with what they're seeing off the trailer for this collection. But I tend to look at the trailer, you know, form a few thoughts and then wait till I get, get it in my hands, especially if it's games I've never played before. So if you're new here, this is the Evercade fan channel, just something's having fun. And you never know, we could spread our wings all over the place in the coming years. But right now we're all about the Evercade gaming system. I don't want to have her closed doors. Probably would have to change the name of the channel. Wonder if there's hmm, a channel name out there that could be available. Anyway, let's go. We're going to play Big Karnak. Not to be confused with Little Karmak. All right. So we're just going to get in and play this from 1991. And this is the arcade collection. So we got Attack Jump, Insert Credits. Yeah, let's get into this. This is the one I probably, out of the trailer, had the most anticipation for. I love these checksum ROMs stuff that we get here. Let's get some coins in here and here we go. This is probably the one that kind of interests me because I love ancient Egypt. I love history in general and uh, this one speaks to me a little bit. So I guess that's Big Karnak and I'm Little Karnak. I don't know. Okay so that's attack. So it's, it's a hack and slash kind of. That guy like took forever to kill. Is he really dead though? Wow, I really look at this game. I mean, the character is kind of small, but I mean, this arcade game, you would expect a bigger character size. And uh, right now, it's just, oh, there's a snake. One hit for the snake, no mummies. So I guess I'm a pharaoh? Is that how it works? Oh my god, oh my god, did you see that? I just, oh, cool. You can hit the eggs back at the uh, the monkeys, or the eggs, the, my god, coconuts. Oh, uh, you got me there. Lovely bunch of coconuts. Get out of water here. Oh, cool. I got something. Oh, I got a timer. Okay. Got to jump out of that. The jump is kind of stiff. Oh, is that a checkpoint? I shouldn't have hit that. So the jump is kind of stiff. I can let you know that right now. And it seems like certainly certain. Oh my God, the, gu the, the skeletons. So I guess a, a plague is taking over Egypt. Can I go in here? No, I can't go in there, which is weird. Man, that's the biggest scarab I've ever seen. A beetle or whatever you want to call him. Oh, oh my gosh, he got me. Oh no, my heart is gone. It fell out of my chest. Oh, it hurt my back. Okay. Oh my god, a scorpion. Oh, I need a sword. Where's my sword? Oh my god, I, did I just kung fu? Oh my god, <laughs> he's like assassinating me. Oh Man, I'm pretty tough though. Can I pause this? No. I need to get up here. That snake is pain in the butt. Gotta jump up here? How do I jump up here? Ah, oh, man, that sucks. How do I get up there? <laughs> okay, this game is pretty, pretty dope. I do like this game. But I, how am I not getting up here? There you go. Oh, you, that's weird, right? Oh my gosh. <laughs> the snake took me down. Oh my god. Oh, it's a one-hit kill on the snake. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm just gonna punch him until I knock him out. Cool. Got a timer. So getting up is like, I, I think you gotta time the jump. I don't know. Let's keep progressing. I need to get a sword. All right. I'm dead. All right. That is Little Kermak. I, I can't wait to get back into this one a little bit. Maniac Square. So that was what I expected it to be, which is fun. It's my style, right? Maniac Square. Okay, let's get, get in here, get some credits going. All right, single game. So I think this is kind of like 
I, I just say it all. It's all Tetris to me. Yep, feels like Tetris. Looks like Tetris. I don't know what else I gotta do here. I'm just flipping it. Not my cup of tea, like... Eh. You know, it is what it is, right? What are you gonna do with these... Ooh, that was a good save. Um, people love these games. Who am I to argue with people who love this stuff? Just not my jam. You know? Just don't, like, Tetris was Tetris. I think it was the best there ever was. Best there ever will be in this genre, right? I, I extended play, okay. I did something good there. I got some more seconds. Next 11 lines in 60 seconds. Yeah, I don't know if that I'll be able to do that, but I'll try my best. That was pretty cool. What's that star do? Ah! I'm really not good at this game. Ah! Why did I do that? Ah! Now I'm just like, yeah. I don't know if I'll ever play this game. Probably on my casual stroll. <laughs> Probably give it. Oh, that was that. All right, all right, all right. Uh, extended. I don't know how that happened. Okay, so there you go. That's that game. Squash. All right, so, so this is squash. Hard swing, soft swing. So at, at least the controls are simple. Like, and this could potentially be fun. A simple fun game. It definitely has the ear markings of that. So get some credits going. Let's get going. All right, so you can be a German, an American, Russia, uh, Italy, Japan, Spain, Brazil, Turkey? <laughs> Where the heck is Canada? That's BS right there. BS, I'll choose the American. I'll choose the Yankee. All right. Okay, that's Feels pretty good. Okay, I should, gotta go. At least it shows you where it's gonna go to. Squash is probably this is probably much more fun in real life. Oh, look at that dive! Oh my god, I hurt myself. Oh, I didn't get over there fast. <laughs> look at dude flaunting and gloating. You're punk. I don't like you. Oh. He doesn't move the fastest. <laughs> the computer is really good. Oh, I missed that. I need to be better. I need to be better. So this guy, this guy, uh, Galico, 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 whatever you want to call it. Yeah, I got a point. You're cheering on me. Ow. Oh, they beat me 5 1. All right. Not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Now we're going to get strikes back. So this is Thunder Hoop 2. Super shot, normal shot, and jump. All right. So I got a feeling I'm going to really like this game. I, I, I just, I think this could be, and this and little Karnak could honestly be what saves this cart. Just saying. Just saying. I'm Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan. Oh, look at that. Look at the Rambo-esque style. These muscles have muscles. All right. I don't want to spoil the intro for people. I just want to get a look at it again. Okay. So, whoa. Okay. Oh man, look at this dude! Oh, I love this game already. You can shoot into the. Shoot up, you can do all kinds of stuff. Okay, these ladies are naughty looking. And I'm disintegrating these. Are they aliens? I think they're aliens. Because they're not wearing much clothes, I can tell you that. Oh, and I'm dead already. It's gonna be one of those games. Who designed these aliens? Somebody was like. Taking a little bit too much of the of the sweet tea when they made this game. 
Oh man, that lady. Like these. <laughs> not much left to be desired in those suits. Kill the eggs. Kill the eggs. Like alien symbiotes. Oh, right, this game is super fun. Like I really enjoy this game. Really, really, really. Okay, of course I'm gonna continue. And I'm gonna spawn right here. And I'm gonna do a massive super shot. Because that's what I can do. Okay, this is where the jumping comes in. Please, okay. Alright. Alright. There's like comets falling. Oh. What is this? Oh my god! <laughs> this is awesome! Oh my god, what is that? This is like a donut. Oh my god, did you. S like, they're just exploding in very hypersexual ways. Like, come on, seriously? The donut works for me. Man, my gun is like. Whatever I'm shooting, is it my wrist of power? Oh, wow. <laughs> this game is too for fun. I like this game a lot. You will like this game a lot. If you're into like crazy, freaky alien stuff, you'll like this game. So, I'm gonna. I gotta come back and play this one. That's awesome. Again, this is just my first impression. So, first impression, yeah. Okay, so beach volleyball. I'm a huge super, uh, super uh, beach volleyball fan. Super Strike Bab. You know, I, I just love the one on the NES. I think it's Super Spike V Ball. It's called. Okay, Team One. Smack. All right. So we got USA, Brazil, Japan. Why is there no love for Canada? You know what? Screw it. I'm taking the coldest country I can think of, and it's Norway. The Black Jaws. Wow, look at the shark. USA, what is yours supposed to be? Okay. Okay, only one jump and shoot. Okay, controls are... It's got a feeling. Got a feeling like it's uh, a lot like uh, the pre-rendered graphics it looks like on there. One button is definitely simplistic controls, which is not a bad thing. Oh, I thought he was going to spike my way. Oh, you see that? You see that? I'm so good at these games. I just like this game because I spiked all over the dude. Block time. Oh, baby. I don't even set it. I am just spiking it all over him. Okay, I like this game. I like it a lot. Oh, crap. There you go. Let my partner get a spike. Oh! That was my bad. My bad, pink short guy. That was on me. That was all on me. Okay, let's see where he's going. Computer's quite responsive. Okay, get it to me. Oh, my. Oh, you see that dig? Oh, I just I never did a proper. All right, let's go. Oh, oh, I, I jumped way too early. Okay, this game is great. I love this game. I don't care what you say. I love a good game of beach volleyball. All right, and the game I feared I'd hate right from the start, World Rally 2. Got a feeling I'm not going to like it. Convince me you're better than World Rally 1. I know, I know a lot of people like World Rally 1. I thought it was hot garbage. Just trying to be honest with y'all. Just trying to keep it real. Alright, let's do this. The graphics does look better, so <laughs> choose a rally. Expert, no. Difficult, no. Normal, no. I'll never get to see the rest of it because <laughs> easy is too hard for me. I know, I know. Oh, where am I? At? All right, let's get going. Three, two, one. Graphics are sweet in this, though. I got, I gotta say, the graphics are nice. I just can't stay on the road. For the love of God, feels like it controls a little better. But no matter what, I'm not fast enough. Like, if I don't go full out on the gas, I have no chance of making it to the 60-second timer. 
I do love the graphics though. See, if the game was tuned a little bit easier, I'd love it, to be honest with you, because I feel like there's no way I can be perfect and not get to the finish line. Maybe it's changed. See, I got a break there, and I, I haven't flipped yet, so that's good news. Because the other one, all I did was flip, but we'll see, right? This is like the best I can do at it, and I, I'm not going to hit the 60 seconds. Oh, 57, what was should I have gotten? Right, stage 1, your position. So, 13th. How do you do it faster? I mean, stage two, which I'm going to quick save that because that will never happen again. Like, but how do you, like, anyway, it's already, oh, God, okay, I'm at night now. Already better than the first one, just saying. I'm super safe. Okay, so I like this. Already it's better than the first one. Maybe I'm just going to go balls to the wall here and just see how far I can push the push it and go full speed. I think that's basically what I'm going to have to do here. Because the other one I couldn't do this full speed out without breaking on the corners because I keep flipping the car. You know, and you don't want to do that, right? You, you, because when you make one mistake in World Rally 1, you're like that, you're done. I don't know what the green arrow means. Is this the super straightaway? Oh, reduced, uh, I can't believe I'm playing this for this long. Yeah. I think the cart could have done without these game, this game, to be honest with you. And there you go, the flipping started. No way I'm going to get it within 60 seconds. There's no mini-map either, so I don't know how far I am into this. <laughs> but I do appreciate the graphics. The graphics are awesome. I don't even know if I care to play this enough time exceeded. There you go. But uh, maybe I'll try it. Maybe look for some tactics. So there you go. This is my first impression of the Gaelco. You know, what do I think of it? First impression? Of course I need to dig myself in. Like, really play this. That's why the casual stroll through series is there. Because that gives me a lot of time to just play it and retry it and stuff. Right now? Not bad. Not nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be. That's, but that's basically where I'm at with it right now. Once again, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye, everyone.